Hey everyone, Joel Hansen here, and today we're at Mally's in Southgate, Michigan, which is just outside Detroit, to try their two pound taco challenge, two pounds. So what this is, the challenge consists of three of their two pound tacos, which have two pounds of meat, plus all the additional fixings, etc. Randy Santel just did this challenge a couple weeks ago. Uh, he did it in like 29 minutes, 55 seconds, out of a 30 minute time limit, and he figured it was about eight pounds of food. So the record is somewhere around 20-ish minutes, he said. Let's head on in, see what we can do. Uh, for completing the challenge, it, you get the tacos for free. I uh, believe you get a $100 prize. You also get a t-shirt, so that's pretty cool. Uh, but let's head on in. And I think that's it. I feel like I'm forgetting something, though. Oh, and if you uh, do not complete the challenge, it is 45 bucks. So let's get some tacos. These things are absolutely massive. I've never seen tacos so big. But uh, we're going to get some beverages, and we're going to give it a go. So let's get started. We'll say the count of five. Welcome to today's video. Today we're at Mally Sports Bar and Grill just outside of Detroit. Here we are doing their two pound taco challenge as we mentioned, which consists of three tacos, each having two pounds of meat. You have a choice of either beef or chicken. I went with two beef and one chicken. So each taco probably weighs about two and a half to three pounds each. You do have a 30 minute time limit. Current record is about 20 minutes. Uh, again, as I mentioned with two beef, one chicken, which I did think was a good choice. The beef was not overly flavored, but the chicken was not overly flavored either, so kind of nice to have a little bit of variety. There was lettuce, tomatoes, lots of cheese, and salsa and sour cream on the side. Not mandatory, which was great because I don't like sour cream, but salsa I do enjoy. Um, also a few jalapenos in there, so it was really nice. Got the full shebang, I guess you could say. Um, so I just went to town on these tacos. I wasn't sure what to expect. Actually, in fact, I was expecting them to be very, very hard after seeing Randy take 30 minutes to do them. So with that, I'll let you get the rest of the video. Let's see what happens, and let's eat tacos. Maybe about 
six and a half minutes in. taco challenge with three over two pound tacos. Uh, these are two pounds of meat on them. It was really good, very tasty. Um, so that is also, I believe, a new record. Just over 11 minutes, about 11.09. Uh, Randy Santel did this in about 30 minutes. So, pretty cool. Enough to explain there. For winning, would you get a $100 gift card and probably our name on the wall of fame, and a t-shirt, and a t-shirt. So everyone, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Until next time, stay happy, healthy, hungry, and happy eating. Successfully did it. That's pretty cool. Uh, didn't take too long. I was going at a reasonable pace uh, using a spoon. I would say the, the there's a lot of like residual moisture in it. Like the chicken and ground beef wasn't dry or anything, so that definitely helped. I did have salsa. I didn't really use that. I used a little bit just for fun. Uh, if I wanted to, if I didn't adjust my music and stuff, we probably could have shaved off another I don't know 30 seconds a minute. Um, but anyway, it was a cool challenge. This is a really cool place here in Mali. So. They currently have the record for the world's biggest commercially available burger. And they have repeatedly had the world's biggest burger. I still have food on my face, excuse it. But like, here's when they made a 340 pound burger. Here's when they made a 340 pound burger. Wait, three, 380, 340. Here's when uh, Adam Richman, Man vs. Food, came here. Back in 2009, and their burger, that burger there was 180 pounds. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And currently their burger that is available 
The burger that you can order, I think it's 1,800 pounds. Yeah, so it's like $10,000, an 1,800 pound burger. So if you ever like have any reason to want an 1,800 pound burger, literally almost a ton, uh, you can do that. So that's pretty cool. But you also have another burger challenge here. It's called the 10 pound burger challenge. Uh, for completing that, you do get 100 bucks, you have two hours. Maybe I'll inquire about that. What about everyone? Thanks for tuning in. Really appreciate you watching. Then we're going to get some more eating.